Happy Friday, beautiful soul family. This is Adrian here at Our Sacred Space on vlog number two. I was just uh, waking up and decided uh, to share with you my personal oral hygiene. I am 33 years old and I've never had a cavity. I would have to thank my father for that, uh, making sure that I always brushed my teeth when it was the appropriate time, and myself for actually brushing my teeth. Honestly, I know they tell you in the dentist to floss every day, but I really think it's uh, um, um, it's how much you scrape off whatever is lining your gums and your teeth. Uh, not necessarily unhealthily, like scraping off your enamel, but making sure that every day, twice a day, when you wake up, so that uh, when you're sleeping, you're actually detoxing and a lot of things are coming out of your mouth, <clears throat> coming from the pores in your mouth and your tongue. So when you wake up, you wanna make sure to scrub that out and scrape your tongue, get all get all that bacteria out of your mouth, start the day fresh. And the way that I like to do that is with hydrogen peroxide. This bad boy, you can get food grade hydrogen peroxide, 3% food grade hydrogen peroxide, or this already comes pre-mixed with a certain um, uh, essential oils. So I just rinse that and gargle with it and brush my teeth with it and if you're gonna brush your teeth make sure if you if you can get yourself one of these mechanical ones so that you really are brushing them really good I believe this is Philips Sonicare and I have this little bad boy on here because when we use the restroom and we flush the toilet the particles go everywhere so you want to make sure to keep your toothbrush nice and sanitized and make sure to wash it once in a while with hydrogen peroxide as hydrogen peroxide is going to um, uh, disinfect it and uh, and if you're going to use toothpaste I recommend using fluoride free toothpaste um, it is now known that fluoride is a neurotoxin uh, as it was before it still is now so make sure you're switching over to fluoride free toothpaste it looks the same it tastes the same it just doesn't have the chemicals in it and what I personally like are you can make your own by the way make your own uh, toothpaste very simple with the activated charcoal, bentonite clay, fossil shell flour, um, and coconut oil. Lots of uh, recipes on Pinterest and YouTube or on, on the line on uh, online and Google. I like uh, brands such as these. This one has propolis in it. Uh, this one has bentonite clay and activated charcoal. Activated charcoal is really good for detoxing and brightening the teeth. Um, those are just a few things that I use. Besides that, that's just the morning routine. In the evening, after you're done eating and after you're done drinking anything that is not water, um, then you're going to brush your teeth very well. Spend a good one to three minutes going uh, both directions, counterclockwise and clockwise, up and down, side to side. Don't, don't not take your time to do it because the time that you put into brushing your teeth is really going to show in your health as most people that have any kind of uh, teeth problems most likely have something internally going on as well. Everything is a reflection to what's happening inside. So I'm only sharing this with you because I feel um, as a, I feel like a unicorn sometimes when people ask me like, oh, how many cavities ha have you had? I've never had a cavity and I'm gonna keep that up. And with these protocols, as well as something I highly recommend is oil pulling. Go ahead and uh, look that up. It's, uh, taking coconut oil on your mouth, swishing it around for at least 10 minutes a day. I do that about two times a week. And that has been shown to reverse all kinds of um, infections and even help if you're already on the route to a uh, root canal, if you will. So thank you very much. I just wanted to get, up, get that off my chest as I feel it's very important to take care of the mouth so that the body can take care of other things. And since we're eating all the time and drinking all the time, it's just something that's always on my mind. Like if you're somebody who has <clears throat> bad breath or a bad taste in your mouth, um, I highly suggest you get hydrogen peroxide and start implementing uh, twice a day brushing teeth uh, protocols and the, the fluoride free toothpaste and the toothbrush that uh, hopefully moves a little better if you're somebody who's lazy already. And hopefully I'll see you guys soon. Thank you.